What's up y'all? My name is Barat. Welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, as you can see, I bought a bunch of stuff, okay? So um, I received an email two days ago from TJX, I think it's called, because um, I'm a Style Plus member for Home Goods, Marshalls, and Winners, right? So um, they gave me, they sent me an email saying that they're opening the stores just for the members for well I guess yesterday because today's the 27th so it was open um, select select Marshalls winners and home goods not home good home sense I'm so sorry <laughs> home sense stores um, across Ontario were reopening so they just wanted to like gradually let people in so they decided to let all the members in first so I was like at first I was like mm, I'm gonna wait to like the border opens up because I live in Canada so I was just gonna cross go across the border and then go to Marshalls and Home Goods and at home there but I decided um the money I'd be saving in like tax and stuff I'm gonna have to pay for it for like a gas for gas and a hotel because I was not gonna do a one day trip I didn't do it. so um I decided to treat this as like a pre-birthday shopping trip you know but um yeah we spent a lot of money i don't know where my receipts are <laughs> i don't know why they decided to put my receipts in the bag okay i have one here don't worry, don't worry. i think the other one is in a bag somewhere so my first trip so in total actually let me calculate my total this is like my first ever haul. I don't really do hauls. This is not so this is something new to my channel. If y'all like it, if you want to see more, okay, bet. I'll go more I'll do more shopping because you know I enjoy shopping. It is my therapy. Okay, so for my first trip I went to Marshall's and I spent $387.96. So basically four hundred dollars. And then um since I don't have the second receipt, I'm just gonna check my um online banking. <laughs> um so my first trip was $387.96 and then my second trip which was Winners and Home Sense together because it was a conjoined store was $306.88 so that all together is $694.84 <laughs> I was just going okay um, it was actually relatively calm because I thought I, I really thought there was gonna be like a long line. I don't know why, but um, yeah, when I pulled up to Marshalls, because Marshalls was my first stop, um, I could I just I was just able to walk in. I showed my um, style member the the membership card thing. Um, I showed them that, and then I got a sanitized cart, and then I just went about my business. So <laughs> um, yeah, we're going to start off. I don't have everything organized simply because I got a lot of stuff. So um, we're just gonna go. We're just gonna do it. We're just gonna dive right in. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please share to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and let's get started. Okay, so the first item is my floor mirror because I um, I'm in law school, but I'm not going back. I'm no let me not say that <laughs> i'm going back but i'm not going for the fall semester because they're weird and they want to do some weird stuff where everybody comes in for the fall semester but we don't after thanksgiving break everybody has to stay back home that makes no sense to me so i'm just doing all of my classes online luckily they are online so yeah um so i decided if i'm gonna stay here for an extra couple months i want my room to be the way i want it to be so that i'm comfortable <laughs> and I get good grades because I don't like my room I'm not gonna stay here and I'm not gonna study and then my grades are just gonna be complete garbage so we don't want that to happen okay cool so the first item I got was my floor length mirror I really wanted a floor length mirror cheap one because I didn't really want to spend that much money originally I was just gonna get like the mirror panels from Ikea because they have like this one it's called the Larbro um I think it's like 28 inches by 47 and then they had like a smaller version with the same width but shorter length so I'm just gonna combine those two and then pop it on my wall but I was like mm -hmm. what if I want to move it so <laughs> I decided to get a floor length mirror I'm gonna insert the clip here showing you guys um, how tall it is I really like it I really wanted something that was black like a black trim so I don't know if I'm gonna like spray paint it matte black so that it fits my vibe because my room is like all gray but I want pops of like white and black you know what I mean so <laughs> so um here's a clip of me showing you guys the mirror okay so this is the mirror 
She's big. I turned the camera upside down. So that's the type of mirror I got. I'm thinking that um, I might like sand this down and then spray paint it black, like a matte black. I'm not entirely too sure. I'm too lazy to move this into my room right now. It is 2 a.m. <laughs> so <laughs> when I finally decorate my room, then I'll move it in there and then I will do a room tour. And that mirror was $79.99, so I feel like that's a great deal. I wanted a mirror that was taller than me because I'm tired. I'm not even that tall, but I can't really find mirrors for a decent price that are taller than me. I'm five foot seven, so um, that mirror I think is 72 inches in length, height, whatever it's called, I don't know. But yeah, I'm really happy I found that mirror. I might spray paint it, we'll see. If, it, if I like how it looks against my room with everything else, um, that I just won't spray paint it. But if I don't, we're spray painting it black. Cause if it were up to me, my entire room would be black. The walls would be black, everything would be just dark. <laughs> the way I sleep I need complete darkness but anyways we're gonna move on I got a photo book it has like I don't know if y'all can see yeah okay so it has like a kind of like a family tree in a sense and then it's like um I don't know if it's leather I don't think it's leather because it would have been way more expensive but um it says the story of us so I'm gonna put like all the family pictures in here because we have like a lot of physical pictures and stuff that are just like in tubs so i just want to put it all in here and it comes with um it holds up to 500 uh photos it's acid free archival safe so i guess your pictures won't get ruined in it and i got this for 16.99 so not bad i really like it and it's black it's black you know what I mean? so <laughs> we're gonna put that there i guess i should grab this thing it is my computer chair <laughs> I really wanted one that fit my color scheme um, and I wanted it to be comfortable I just used it to film this look and it was quite comfortable I didn't have to worry about like my back hurting I think cuz I, I just have great posture anyways <laughs> so um, it was originally $59.99 but I got it on clearance for $45 so it has wheels and all that stuff it can roll and it's, it has an adjustable height so I really like that that was $45 flat um, next I got I got some stuff not only for like my room <laughs> I got some stuff not only for my room but also for like around the house because I'm the main cook of the house and I just want my kitchen to look how I want it to since I'm the main cook okay so other people's opinions in this house don't matter but they seem to think that they do but when you're the main cook in the house you have the final say okay so <laughs> um our paper towel handle paper towel holder broke so I decided to get another one this one is just regular stainless steel oh oh Okay. Yeah, it's just a regular stainless steel paper towel holder. It was originally $8.99, got it on clearance, and it was $6. So that's a good deal. Next, I got um, straws um, because I got mason jars, and I really wanted them. I wanted straws that I could reuse, you know? So if I can be like eco friendly and all that stuff, I guess save the turtles and all that jazz. Why not? So I got two. Um, it come both sets come with four straws and then um a cleaning brush and then they were both four dollars they were originally 5.99 yeah cool next i got oh i have some wrapped up stuff here for my bathroom i got um a black drinking cup for my washroom that was 6.99 um and i also got um, what is it called? A soap dispenser. <laughs> a soap dispenser for $9.99. And it has like the clean, sleek cut. It's matte on the top, but it's kind of shiny on the bottom. Not too shiny to where it's like glam, because I hate glam. That is not my kind of thing. I hate it with every fiber of my being. It irritates my soul. So, <laughs> um, I got this. I just like minimalist. Not minimalistic. I'm a very, to be honest with y'all. I am an industrial farmhouse whore, okay? 
I love industrial farmhouse. I like my house to look like a house, to look like a home, to get that home feel. With like glam decor, I do not get that. With modern decor, I do not get that. So <laughs> I like industrial farmhouse. Um, the darker, the better, but <laughs> that's not, that's a, that's a topic for another day. So I also got um, herbs because um, I follow um, a chef on Instagram. I follow a lot of chefs actually, but um, one that I that recommended this was um, Chef Risha. She's the owner and creator of Carnal Dish and her recipes are fire. So she said, what you need in your pantry is um, Herb de Provence, I think that's what it's called. So I got two, <laughs> I got two jars and they were $7.99 each. So put that right there because if I put it, try to put it on the floor, it will break. Okay, so that's one bag down. <laughs> we got 50 levens to go. Okay, so to continue with, um, I guess, because I can differentiate which store I got it from because they all come in different bags. Um, to continue with Marshalls, um, I got a sweater because my vibe is cozy, comfortable, and cute. That's it. I don't like to be all dolled up, this, except for my face and my hair. That is it. I like heels though. So, <laughs> I'm a weird breed. I am a tomboy, but I could sprint in heels, you know, because my mom forced me to. But, <laughs> so, but um, anyways, I got this Mickey, ooh, this Mickey hoodie. She is cute. What brand is it actually? What is it? It's just Gildan. Somebody printed it, that's it? What brand is this? Neff. I don't know what brand this is. I just thought it was cute. It says Neff. <laughs> And it's like Mickey in a camo, and it said on the bottom, it says, too many people grow up, I guess. Yeah, I got it because it was cute. That's honestly the only reason. <laughs> and I need more hoodies. Um, okay, next. Oh, it was $29.99. Um, next, I got some skinny syrups. I actually got four of them. I like to put them in my smoothies and stuff. Um, and my drinks so <laughs> I got four I got um Meyer lemon raspberry they're all in Jordan skinny syrups I don't know if it'll focus on me focus on it I have no idea but I got Meyer lemon raspberry I got mango um, oh don't fall please um, I got strawberry watermelon and then I also got peach they are zero calories, zero sugar, you know, so on the healthy vibes and stuff. <laughs> and each of them were $5.99. So I got four of those. Let me put that down. Ooh. Oh dear, okay. All right, next I got this um, Vince Camuto Down Alternative Comforter. It was, I don't know, cause it's covered. I paid $53 for it. I got it in a queen because I have a queen size bed. Um, if I found a king, I would have got a king because I like big, big comforters simply because I like to wrap myself up <laughs> like a burrito. <laughs> but I still like the house to be cold. It's weird. Oh, I peeled off the thing. I think it says $69.99. I think that's how much it was. I'm not entirely sure. But yeah, it's all white because I'm going for the all white vibe on my bed now trying to be a I don't know I don't I guess not a grown-up I don't know <laughs> I guess I don't want my decor to be like too dark in a sense because I already have a black comforter so I will be switching it out depending on my mood so <laughs> next I got a bunch of pillows um, and they were actually super cheap I'm gonna I'm definitely gonna need like a lint roller I'm gonna see if I can like throw it in the wash I don't know we'll see I don't know but um I got these I don't know what size they are Ooh. I'm not entirely sure but they were originally $24.99 two black pillows I'm not entirely sure what material this is but um I paid six dollars for two pillows 
amazing okay cool <laughs> and then i also got um where is it is it here yes i got like the rectangular version of them a two set i got the rectangular version of them a, another two set for only four dollars okay that is amazing they are um mm studio brand i don't know what i've never heard of it before but yeah definitely gonna need a lint roller for these though so toss it okay next we are gonna jump into purses for a bit because you know i'm trying to expand my purse collection because i used to be the tomboy who would just carry everything in their pockets like my wallet my cash my cards my phone didn't care it was comfortable for me to it still is comfortable but you know i gotta grow up one day so <laughs> i decided to expand my purse collection last year was when it, really when i like spent a lot a lot a lot a lot a lot of money on purses but this year we're gonna like go the smart route and like go to like the discount stores like marshall's winners and TJ Maxx, Ross, all those places. Yeah, so um, I got this, I guess it's like a bucket bag in a sense. I'm not entirely sure. It's really cute. It's black and white. It's by Carlos. It's the brand, it says Carlos by Carlos Santana. I think it's super cute. It'd be great on vacation, I think, like for those vacation looks. I'm here for it. And it was originally $29.99, but I paid $15 for it. So. Oh, and it comes with a long strap too. So let me unzip it. Yeah, yeah, it has a lot of space in here. I could definitely fit my wallet and my phone and my camera when I vlog. Look how big that is. That is amazing. Okay, I got this purse. I don't know if this will be like a belt bag. I don't know. I just got it because I don't have a blue purse. It's by Steve Madden. Um, she's spacious how do i open this oh <laughs> ah. <laughs> she's not as spacious as the bucket bag but that's okay she has like two different compartments three actually because it has one a zipper in the middle so yeah she's cute um i paid eight dollars for this so a steal um i think it's really cute i can like wear it I wouldn't wear blue with this, honestly. I probably wear like blue shoes. So it's not like an overkill of blue because blue is like the main feature of the purse. So we're gonna put that down there. I have one more purse that I got. I don't know where it went. Oh, right here. I got this. This is completely out of my comfort zone, but I feel like she would be cute for like those casual cute looks. Like in the grass, if I was going on a picnic, even though I don't really go on picnics because I refuse to sit on the ground. But <laughs> I feel like I could create that illusion with this purse. So it's like um, woven, I don't know what it's made out of. I have no idea. It's from Zara actually. I just noticed that. So I feel like I could create looks with these. So, I mean with this. Um, it, it says 26 pounds on here. I don't know what that is in Canadian. I'm so sorry. But originally it was $9.99. But they, I got it on clearance for seven dwellers. I'm here for it, okay? I'm here for it. Okay, so that's all of my purses. Now we're going to move on to... I guess I should just finish up like my bed bedding stuff and like my room stuff, I guess. Yeah, okay, cool. I got these big, big, big <laughs> Euro pillows. It's a set of two. It is 26 by 26 from Hotel Ball 4. Yeah. <laughs> it was 20, they were $29.99. So I'm gonna be putting this on the bed. You know? Cool. All of these I'm just gonna have to go through the wash because I refuse. <laughs> With everything going on. Um, next, I got a throw pillow. No, a Sherpa blanket. I don't know what I was thinking to throw a pillow, but I got it because it's gray. I don't know if y'all can see it. This is the pattern it comes in. It's from Cozy Cottage. I 
still don't I, again i don't know what brand that is but it feels soft and i feel like because like when i go into my room to like edit and stuff i like to get under the covers and i like what's the word take apart my bed <laughs> in a sense just to get under my comforter so instead of me having to go into my comforter i can just put this blanket over and it's queen size too so it's not gonna feel too small on me um it was originally let's see let's peel it off because i also got this on clearance um girl it was originally 39.99 and I got it just for $9. I'll be finding the sales. I find the sales all the time, okay? Period. And then I got some I got some velvet hangers because I needed extra ones. Um, I like velvet hangers because they don't put creases in my clothes. That's basically it. And they're black. Because I don't. Girl, wire hangers. My mama taught me never to keep wire hangers, okay? So <laughs> I got 30, a pack of 30 for $19.99. We're gonna put that there. And then I think that, okay. Okay, let's move on to, oh, actually, I have one more piece for my bathroom. And um, I know how I said I hate glam stuff, and I do. So what I have for this, I got an organizational vanity tray. And as you can see, there's like mirror on it, but we're gonna spray paint this matte black. I don't have time <laughs> we're gonna spray paint it matte black and i'm just gonna put like all my skincare serums on here to put on like my bathroom counter counter um i got it for 14.99 there's no sale on it but it's really cute i feel like it would fit it matches with you see that looks really cute i know it's not gonna be on here but i feel like you get the vibe i'm going for it because my washroom is all white I love my washroom actually <laughs> it's actually so peaceful um my dad renovated it for me when i came back from my first year of law school no when i came back during my christmas break of my first year of law school so i'm really happy it's way bigger i got a massive shower um but everything is just all white so i want to put like pieces of black in there you know what i mean so yeah i got ooh, is that it okay I got this, um, I think it's a cake tray. It's a footed round server by Patisserie. Yeah, cause I plan on making my own birthday cake this year. I'm going to go out my comfort zone cause I do, I all I know how to do properly, like well, well without any like help or anything is cook, okay? But baking, girl, it's too much work. You gotta follow instructions and stuff. Like you can't just go off and do your own thing or else. What you make will turn into a catastrophe. So I'm gonna challenge myself and me and my baby brother we're gonna make my favorite cake, which is cookies and cream. I'm gonna try to make black velvet for it, so we will see. But yeah, um, it's a glass cake holder thing. Um, it was I got it for five dollars and I'm happy that I did. Someone else was eyeing it and I was like, girl, I'm gonna scoop this out before you do. <laughs> Uh, I can't peel the sticker off, so I don't know how much it was originally. But yeah, I feel like that's a great steal. Okay, I have two more kitchen items. I got um, this premium poly granite cutting board by Dexis. It's massive. I just wanted the extra cutting board because my brother, like, I need my brother to. I don't need my brothers to be um, inept, you know. So they need to learn how to cook. So. <laughs> I make my baby brother get in the kitchen with me while I'm cooking so that he will be good when he grows up, even though he's 16 right now. He's still a baby. But um <laughs> yeah, I make sure that they get in the kitchen because I don't want them to be stupid, you know? You can't just be dribbling a ball and not know how to do anything else, okay? You know, you need to learn how to like live by yourself in a sense, I guess. So yeah, I got another cutting board, so this will be mine, and then my old one will be his. <laughs> All right, let me put that there. I think, oh no, yes. I have one more kitchen item. I just got these um, Tupperware, this locking container set. Cause I like the ones that lock when I put food in, simply because it's, it's safer. Not safer, yeah, it is safer cause my food won't leak. So 
I got it. Did I say how much I got the cutting board for? I got the cutting board for $14.99. But um, I got this locking container set. It comes with 16 pieces. So eight containers and eight lids. Um, there's a very big, big one at the bottom. So I'm just going to use that for storing food and stuff, I guess. Um, but yeah, it was originally $16.99 and I got it for $13. So I'm happy about that. Where am I going to put you? Okay. <laughs> Okay, I think we're on to clothes. No, we're not. Girl, what did you buy? You bought a lot of stuff. I love dried pineapple. Pineapple is my favorite fruit of all time. I love pineapple, broiled pineapple with cinnamon, brown sugar, and a hint of cayenne. Legendary. So, <laughs> I got dried pineapple slices. These are like my favorite snacks to eat. Um, I used to get it in this snack subscription box thing, but I didn't feel like uh, the only reason why I got the subscription box was for the dried pineapple slices. So if I could get it for something else, there's no point, you know? So um, these were originally $6.99. I always check my expiry dates before I buy like food items and stuff. Like I learned very quickly not to buy any more skincare from them after like i couldn't open my eyes from trying a new eye cream girl what was that that was ridiculous i was crying and everything but i couldn't even open my eyes so like i was flooding my own tears whatever <laughs> but um these were originally 6.99 and i got them for five dollars each i have another one i bought two more elsewhere they're like smaller packs i don't know where they went oh they're right here i got more these are organic dry pineapple i got two packs because that's all i saw there and they were two dollars each and these expire don't don't expire until next year so you know i'm safe if i'm not i'm sued <laughs> all right and then i think oh i have one more bedding thing um i got two standard side size pillowcases because i do have um bamboo pi pillows get into it you will love it bamboo or charcoal they will be your best friend okay um i got two standard pillowcases white um i don't have to worry about staining my pillowcases and my sheets with makeup because one thing i don't do is fall asleep with my makeup on i refuse no matter how drunk i am i have makeup wipes on deck okay i have never fallen asleep with my makeup i will never will i never will i refuse because i i can know for because you want to know how i know <laughs> You wanna know how I know? I don't wear makeup without my contacts and I don't fall asleep with my contacts in. So if I have my contacts in, I'm gonna know that I need to take them off. And then when I look in the mirror to take them off, I'm gonna notice I have makeup on my face, you know? Logistics. <laughs> so yeah, I don't have to worry about staining my sheets of having like all white bedding and stuff. So, you know? Okay, next is, oh one more home item i guess in a sense um i got this key and mail rack thing yeah it's a wall mount mail and key rack um it's a mail basket with six hooks it looks like that she's cute um it's like a deep brass color i think i don't know it's like a dark dark metal brown i think yeah <laughs> So I'm just gonna tell everybody to pop their keys in here and put the mail in here because my older brother likes to put the mail on top of the fridge. Nobody checks for their mail on top of the fridge. It makes no sense and it pisses me off because I'll be expecting something and then I'll go to my room and I don't see my mail there because usually my baby brother, he'll put my mail on my desk or my dad will just let me know that I have mail and I'll just go check the ledge upstairs. But my older brother, I don't know what's wrong with him. He wants to put it on top of the fridge because he's the tallest in the house, I guess. And he thinks that everybody can see where he can see. And that's just not the case. So, <laughs> I'm getting this and I'm putting this right above the light. The light switches in the kitchen so that, you know, you see it there. Boom. Cool. And then, I guess that's it for home stuff. We're going to jump into clothing. Okay, so I got some pieces for my dad and my brothers. Um, my dad is into... What are they, I don't know what this is. Is this called a rugby shirt? <laughs> I 
he has questionable taste but i was like you know what let me just get him something <laughs> so i got him this tommy hill figure i live with tall people okay so i have to get stuff in like double xl xl sometimes triple xl just for the like the length the arm sleeves and stuff so that it could fit them so i got this tommy hill figure i think it's a rugby shirt um in there i think it's these are their colors right i don't know girl i don't know i don't wear tommy but my dad likes them so <laughs> likes the brand so um this was originally well their tag on here the tommy brand says that it's 129.50 girl for what <laughs> but here does that say is that a nine hold on that can't be a nine because it um in store at where did i get this from marshall's <laughs> um in marshall's it was 39.99 i paid 24 dollars for it so not bad that's for him and then my older brother is a zara fiend so i decided you know i saw some zara pieces so let me go get him some. I don't think this is gonna fit him because it's just a large. And he's six foot ten. So <laughs> it's a thought that counts, you know. Um <laughs> it's a Zara, it's just a regular cream colored Zara turtleneck, and it was originally what is this? $12.99, but I got it on clearance for $8. I don't know who this is gonna fit because it's not gonna fit my baby brother either because he's six foot eleven. This is just gonna be a crap top on them. This is a waste of money. Maybe I can like. I think one of my my goals should be like learning how to sew, so that I could take their stuff and transform it for myself. You know. So, <laughs> we're gonna see. Um, I don't know. I feel like they're gonna cuss me out because <laughs> it's not the right size. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness okay as mentioned before my favorite items of clothing my favorite trend of clothing is cozy comfortable cute so i like to wear long sleeves with sweats for the cozy vibes so <laughs> i got this in the men's section honestly the men's section is my favorite place i don't know why they closed forever 21 down but the men's section was my spot okay like most of my hoodies long sleeves t-shirts um pants but not like jeans are from the men's section of forever 21 and i don't know why they decided to close it down in canada um it's actually kind of rude but <laughs> we're not gonna talk about that right now because <laughs> this is not a call for them okay so i got this um white shirt it's from Brooklyn Cloth Manufacturing Company. I got an extra large because I like big shirts. Um, they made me forget that I have a nice body sometimes. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> but it was originally $14.99 and I paid $9 for it. She's a cute girl. She's like colorful and stuff. Can I bleach it? I like to bleach my wipes. Cause since it has like all this color on it, can I still bleach it? Cause how am I gonna maintain the white? Do not bleach. Girl, we'll figure it out. <laughs> we will figure it out. Oh, I have one more kitchen item. I got garlic truffle oil. Cause I really wanted truffle oil. So I got it for $4. It's from Sonoma Harvest. Yeah, that's it. So just put that down there. So I wasn't gonna toss that cause that's a glass. All right, next I got these sunglasses. Um, I think they're cute. You know, they're kind of like reflective in a sense. They, I'm feeling the vibes. I'm feeling the vibes. They're really cute. Um, oh, did I say how much I got the oil for? Four dollars, I think it was. How much will I get? Yeah, four dollars. <laughs> All right, yeah, but these sunglasses were $14.99. They're really cute. I really want those like mini circle glasses. I need to find those. But I don't want to pay a lot of money, you know what I mean? So if I can find them for like a price similar to that, we'll be okay. All right, so I got some pajama pants for myself because I like to wear pajama pants. I'm wearing pajama pants right now. 
<laughs> um, these are from, hmm, I don't know, Property of Bottoms Out. Girl, <laughs> once I read the, I read the words in my head, I had to look at the back to see if the, <laughs> if the back was actually cut out because it says Bottoms Out. Anyways, um, I got this in extra large, just like regular plaid. Um, I guess, is this fleece? I don't know. You know like the material that plaid usually comes in? That. <laughs> um, I just got these so I can wear around the house. I don't wear pajama pants to bed. It's too warm for that. I, don't, I like to be cold while I'm sleeping, but I still like to be warm. I don't know. It's weird. But anyways, um, I got those for $5. And then I got this red dress. And the thing is, yeah, I tried on the large and the large was too big and usually when I get a dress I like to get large just to be safe because these be thing okay <laughs> these like to act up okay they like to act up sometimes and I just don't have time but when I found out that the large was too big the only thing that came up into my mind because I'm like obsessed with TikTok right now is um the, it's like a sound bite which is like you're trying to tell me that I'm skinny cuz girl <laughs> I got this guess red bandage dress in a size medium um, it was originally $24.99 the the label says it was $64.99 for this <laughs> really okay I guess um, <laughs> I paid $12 for it she's really cute She's gonna, she's gonna snatch you up real quick, real cute too. Anyways, um, moving on. I got this, sil is it silk, satin, something. It's something. Dry clean, girl, anyway. Oh, it's silk, okay. I got this silk scarf. See it? Get the vibes I'm getting with this? This is vacation vibes for me. So I'm just gonna use this to like, I'm gonna like fold it into like, and headband width and then just boom it's gonna be oh I cannot wait till the world opens up again um <laughs> it was originally the tag says the tag from wherever this it's echo brand I don't know um the tag says it's forty dollars but I it was originally in store for $16.99 and I paid eight dollars for it I really wanted this this is really cute very out of my comfort zone because as you can see I love black so <laughs> um yeah I got this black um sweatshirt from brunette the label see like this is this is why I don't know when people ask like what size am I I usually go for large this is a small medium sis this is a small medium how how is this a small medium? If you tell me that I'm a small, I'm gonna act up, okay? <laughs> I'm going to act up because, girl, this is not no small, okay? Like, I had to, like, legit check. The sleeves fit, okay? But, um, it says spritz me now, please. I'm not entirely sure what that means. I just got it because it's, like, simple and it's black. <laughs> and it was originally... Girl. What is this? Is that a four? Oh, it was originally $19.99 and I got it for $6 on clearance. Okay, next. We are almost done. We are almost done. I got this, um, it's a set. Oh, let's say. <laughs> I got this pajama set. Again, I don't wear pajamas to bed. I just wear them around the house. So, um, it's a two-piece pajama set. I also got it in a small, I don't know. Girl. Marshalls might be the spot for the like the reassurance that I'm losing weight or whatever because this is a small <laughs> um, it was originally it comes with shorts too so super cute it's pink I'm not a fan of pink but I got it to look cute on me so <laughs> um, they were originally $24.99 and I got it for $8 for both of them not each for a combined two um, is that it? Oh, oh like I said, I think we have 
just like a few more pieces left and then we're done but um i got this room spray sea salt i like fresh scents i'm not a fan of heavily sweet or like heavily floral so it's either fruit or fresh so like clean air clouds um lemon mint i am i love eucalyptus i love tea tree i love sandalwood a little bit of sandalwood i love bergamot i think it's called bergamot bergamot i don't know but those are my top top favorite scents um i got sea salt um and it was only two dollars so most of the like the little trinkets and stuff i got while i was in line to check out so <laughs> um okay we are almost done i got another piece for my older brother hopefully this fits him it's also from zara um it's a t-shirt it should fit him i feel like it should girl because you're not that you're not that big you're just tall <laughs> Um, it was originally $9.99 and I got it for $6. So it's just like um, a t-shirt version of the turtleneck. And then I got these for myself. They're just regular sweatpants from, who are you from? Brooklyn Cloth in extra large because when I wear sweatpants, I like them to be baggy. Um, they were originally $24.99. It has like black detailing. They're like charcoal gray with like black like a heather gray i think more like a heather gray yeah so it has like black detailing and then it it was originally 24.99 and i got it for 12 dollars all right and then i got my dad some sweatpants too um this is the, from the champ champion brand i actually just bought him a tracksuit from champion for a hundred dollars only to find these oh girl i'm annoyed <laughs> But um, I got him these gray because he has the black version of this. If I knew, girl, whatever. Um, I got him in a double XL because, again, the men in my family are tall. It was originally $29.99 and I got it for $10. So as you can see, my heart is hurting from spending that $100. <laughs> so, and then, the, oh, we're on our last, we're on our last piece, y'all. Okay, I got another pair of sweatpants for myself. They are, it's like Toronto Blue Jay merch. I just got it cause they're blue. I don't really care for the whole Blue Jays on the side. Actually, it might look cute, but um, I got them for $16.99. They weren't on sale. So yeah, that is basically it. That is everything that I got. I really hope you guys like this video. If you want more from me, if you want more from me, let me know down below. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.